So here I am, it's day one of me starting my house search because I'm buying a house, 2024. So this is the first property that I'm about to go look at. Well, first set of properties that I'm about to go look at. I'm kind of nervous, not gonna lie. Like, I really don't really know what to expect. Um, I'm gonna make a video like detailing what I did to get to this process because people don't really be transparent about the stuff that you kind of have to do or get together when you want to buy a house. So yeah, come with me on my, you know, trip, my first trip. I'm going to go see three houses today and I'm gonna let y'all know how they go. I'm so excited. So this first house, the problem with me and, and in my house search is that like, I'm one person, right? I'm not really in a relationship. I don't have no kids, but I have a lot of stuff. Um, not even a lot of stuff, maybe like clothes. Like, I really need a good size house. Um, and I also don't want to move or have to move should anything happen in my life. Like, I get married, I get a boyfriend, a long term fiance, whatever the case may be, and I get pregnant and I have a baby. I don't want that to have to force me to move. Um, I'm 24. I don't really see myself really having no kids or nothing like that right now. But, you know, as you get older, you got to be realistic. So, I just have been really trying to keep in mind, like, I don't want to be forced to move. And a lot of things, and another thing that's kind of like being a big factor is the fact that I want to, you know, vacation home, this home, um, maybe after five or six years. So I have to pick a house that's in a relatively good location in terms of Atlanta. Like, it need to be relatively close. Um, but everything in my budget, like, staying in your budget is kind of hard for real. Especially when the market is so trash. So, we're going to see. I'm about 10 minutes away from it. It's kind of close to my apartment now. My apartment now is in South Florida. I love the South Side. I don't really want to go north. That was kind of another problem is that like I could get some stuff north, but I don't want to be north of Atlanta for real. Um, just because south of Atlanta is what I know. Like I'm a Clay Co baby for real. Um, so like all my people is in Clayton County or in like Union City, Forest Park. Like that's still Clay Co, but well Union City, not Clay County. Whatever. So I'd rather go, if I have to go further out, I would rather go further to the south not further to the north and i really could care less about the the east side either like i don't really care about latonia i don't really want to be if i gotta go past decatur i can't do that so i'm kind of confined because i only really want to be in like i'm okay with maybelline mableton austell i'm okay with douglasville that's pushing it um i could do smyrna cop you know right there in cumberland i could do south fulton that's my area for real i want to be in south fulton that's where i really want to be at like right in that run at cascade camp creek campbellton like adamsville that's really where i want to be at for real um but the houses are so much they're just such in an older style that it's kind of making it hard for me but this is the first one like i said is right here in south fulton still um we're gonna see what the neighborhood is like it's just a lot of things you gotta consider like jesus christ I'm pulling up on a house i think right now i'm so like nervous i don't know why i'm so nervous my best friend was supposed to come but y'all know she just had a baby so she was busy with the baby this morning couldn't make it out but that's okay i'm not really tripping about it um i do know that the house is coming up though so i just passed it Oh, okay, let's just turn around. Let's just turn around. I'm gonna... I also don't really care for this driveway. Like, just imagine. Oh no. Oh no, hold on. I'm just gonna park on the street. Cause that's, who is parking right there? pulling that driveway I can't but I'm gonna show y'all when I say steep I mean steep as fuck steep as fuck hey good morning yeah 
Okay. Thank you. Documentation. Well, it's nice to meet you in person. Nice to meet you too. I'm a hugger. I'm like, yeah. I say we won't shake hands. Let's hug. <laughs> so yeah, I definitely came to this home. Um, the driveway is kind of steep, but it's still not. It's not awful. Mm -hmm. Um, it's like it's not working, but it's a nice, you know, a nice, oh, it's especially cute. like a nice starter mm -hmm. for someone looking that, you know, first time home buyer or, mm -hmm. um, whatever, honestly. Okay. I know, I knew the master bedroom was nice. I was looking at it in the so kitchen. this is it right here. This is the master um, bedroom. We got a little dining area here. Or you can make it whatever you want if you don't want a dining area. Mm -hmm. You can even use this space right here. Oh, this is so nice. Area. I love a big bathroom. I'm like really weird when it comes to bathrooms. Uh -huh. Like if I am like too close, I start freaking out because I don't like bathrooms. This is my space. In this, is good, this is a great space. It's a great I was space. actually, I'm shocked at how big it is. I wasn't expecting it to be this big. This is the master. Nice size bedroom. Mm -hmm. oh, I can kind of see it in Sometimes you can, you know, run into homes where the homes, the, the rooms are on the smaller side, mm -hmm. but these are these pretty are... spacious. These are pretty mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Another secondary barrel. Thank you. Here. I like the fans and the sockets. Mm -hmm. Another secondary the, this is a two, what was it, two, yeah, two and a half, so it's the full. It's a nice house. Yeah, it's, really, it's a really nice house. It's a great starter home. Cozy, mm -hmm. like, can make it very homey. Of course, the stuff that you're seeing here, like, the furniture stuff, it won't be, but it gives, like, if you like this style, like, ideas of, like, what you can put mm -hmm. in here, like, the size of it. Um, and yeah, I like your dryer, um, connection is right here. I don't know if you saw it. It's almost like I want to put something right here, but like I, I like it. Okay, it's okay. Keep it in mind, so I do. This more. is definitely, and this is the area that I I prefer this kind Closer of. Closer to the yeah. I love this area. Everybody always talk about South Fulton, but I love. And South this is Fulton. not even South Fulton. This is actually the city of Atlanta. This is Atlanta. Thank you. Who is the... Why I do it so... Okay. Who's the Old dog? Cook, Who dog? dog? Old National. Oh, shit. Good. He'll be alright. Don't run. If you run, he gonna come. Oh, don't. Okay. I'm like, don't run. It could get straight. But, yeah. Old All right. Oh, y'all. I can't get into the same car. Oh, okay. So we at the other house. Um, I don't know why my mom is hating so bad because it's not that bad. Why is my camera zoomed in? It's not horrifying, but. It's not for Dodger. It's not. It's not. Okay. <laughs> like, it's not for Dodger. My mom would lose her shit. Cause I love the outside. Like I love the look of it. Mm -hmm. Such a great size. Wasted. The shed open. You know that? No, I don't. We don't know what's in there. I'm about to say. <laughs> Definitely. I'm so disappointed. But it's gonna be fun. You just love the fun life though. Why would you even let me do that? I told you. This is when it comes down to mother knows best because I told you. <laughs> but you were trying to be nah nah. No, I told you. <laughs> 
I was like, I don't even know why you going in. I'm like, I'm trying to be optimistic, you know, like, I'm okay with making some changes. If I got to, you know, change out a refrigerator or something, I could do that. Girl, that was a mess. I still can't get over the smell. It's, I feel like my throat is itching right now. Like, my throat really is, like, itching. I can't breathe. I need to just stand outside for a little bit. That's how bad that smell really was. I don't think anybody understands. So what about the one that we think that along with it? Oh, where, where is she going? Maybe she's going from the back. Yeah, she is. <clears throat> Super cosmetic. Um, I can tell you this, though. I don't like this way that she took to get here i could tell you that why because these houses is trifling i'm gonna show you look at everybody else's houses uh, no ma'am you're yeah. not living in that neighborhood no i said ma i said um i don't like the way that i we took to get here at all but it's the last house on the street uh, uh turn around no ma'am not gonna be rolling up in a neighborhood that look like we in the ghetto. That means people don't take care of their neighborhood. They don't take care of their house. They nasty. The bugs and the, the mice is gonna be in your house. No. Uh oh. Um, like um, one house on the block that don't take care of their house is a different story than everybody not taking care of their house. Yeah, this one's probably not gonna be it either and it's so sad because i actually like the structure of this house yeah because so but, they don't take care of their house. but it's, that's why it's like it's so many things that come into when you're trying to buy like i can't you see what kind of car i got my my family can't come here all right hold on mom. let me call you back so i can record oh lord she gonna need some tlc What's the, um, what's the inside renovating on this one? Uh, it's not renovated, but it's not old. It's not old. Mm -mm. Is this what you were expecting? No. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. So, I didn't look at all the pictures on these. And I probably would put a slide unless they picked. I don't know. I, I don't even look at the picture, so I can't even get I looked at the pictures and I feel like they lied to me. Why is it an island in a random spot? It's weird. Yeah. But you see what I mean by the kitchen not being like. It's weird. Oh, everything else is. We might as well walk out, Brittany. <laughs> I, I ain't even gonna lie to you. <laughs> I ain't, I'm not. I'm not gonna lie to you because I'm. I'm this. Yeah. Hold on. Let me turn this light on. I'm disappointed. Okay, well, like I said, you find some. Oh, yeah, girl. You see some, you pass, and it's that. You know what I mean? Yeah, we, we, I'm not, I'm not saving the animals. Uh-uh, uh-uh. We, we don't even have to see nothing else. Okay. <laughs> we don't even have to see nothing else. We don't got to see nothing else, because it ain't no floors. Uh-uh, uh-uh. We just gonna walk right back out. I don't even know, I don't even know what they doing with that one. They might well let that go. They need to drop that to 30000 This a whole flip. This a full flip. This ain't a half a flip. This a full flip. Everything need to be replaced. Everything. Everything. It's no way that somebody... And they said this moving ready? I know they didn't say that. I hope not. Because it's no... It's, this is, well, I, was, I was okay with power washing. Doing some landscaping. Maybe changing out an appliance or two. But it's, it's a little bit too much. No, nope, not that one. I'm, that... Mm -mm. I knew it wasn't gonna work when we drove up I'm home and that was definitely experience <laughs> to say the least um the first house I really really loved uh I hate that it was kind of so small I hated the carpet but that's minuscule but um that house had everything aesthetically that I liked I liked the gold accents I love the white cabinets. I love the bathroom space. I love that it was two full baths and a half a bath. In addition to those three bedrooms, 
I wish you had a fourth bedroom. Um, I wish I had a fourth bedroom. That would have did it for me for real. I probably would have been a little bit more eager. And I hated the driveway. Like, the driveway really turned me off, like, real, real, real bad. Like, real bad. Mm -mm. I might have to, like, add some concrete or something. I don't know. Hate it. Hated that. Um, but overall, that first house is beautiful. I really am interested in that first house. I'm going to explore some more, of course. But that first one is definitely a heavy hitter. That second one, I had high hopes for it. Especially because my mom was talking shit about it. So I had high hopes for it. I'm like, I could prove her wrong. The outside of the house, the exterior was really cute to me. I enjoyed the yellow paneling. Like, I liked that or the wood, whatever it was. It was really cute. I didn't really care for the garage, um, the car cart, whatever it's called, the little thing that goes over your car, because they didn't upgrade it. But in the house, I was disappointed, to say the least. Uh, it smelled like cigarettes. It smelled like 30,000 packs of cigarettes were smoked in there every day. Like it was just, and it, it, it wasn't like strong, like somebody had just smoked, but it was like lingering. And that linger is what was like making me itch. Like I literally, when I got back in the car, I could not, like my throat was itching. My throat itching, I don't like that. I don't like that. So it was like they had made one of the like formal dining areas. They tried to make that into a room. So they added a door and then it just didn't work because the back door was in there too. Like it was two back doors. The back door is in there. Why is the back door in the dining room? Or why is the back room in a bedroom? That's not a bedroom. This is a two bedroom house with a dining area. You try to add a door and make another bedroom. That's not it. Um, I didn't really care at all for the flooring in the family room. I did think that the family room was going to be nice. I'm insert some pictures of what I thought it was going to look like. But I realized that the floors were actually concrete. And those little stairs that go into the entryway were actually, like, super huge in concrete. It wasn't giving what I thought it was going to give, like, at all. Um, the bathroom was, like, down there in another room. But the room was definitely not given master bedroom. It it just, it, it was a, I mean, it probably was a guest room with a full bath attached to it. But it just wasn't given. And it was, like, bug traps everywhere. I do want to be aware that the house did have a wooded backyard and it's been vacant. But the amount of bug traps and the amount of bugs on the traps didn't really make the, you know, remodel kitchen or the slightly upgraded bathrooms worth it for me. Um, I did enjoy the space. I did like that it was 200 more square foot than the previous home. But the only thing that I really liked about the house was the outside. Um... Yeah, that house needs about probably about $50,000 worth of remodeling, if not more. The last one, baby, I walked out. The last one was trifling. When I walked up, the neighborhood was terrible. I thought they was going to break into my car, steal it while I was in there, honey. Like, I will say it's two ways to enter the neighborhood. The way that I was going to initially take was a way better um, neighborhood, clean, beautiful houses, whatever the case may be. The way that my realtor took us in, which was the next street over horrifying like i'm in the hood for real and i don't mind i'm from the hood but you know when you leave the hood you ain't i'm not moving into the hood like that's not a place that you move into you move out i mean you know i'm not knocking what people can afford but it was like trash everywhere like abandoned houses the houses are all dirty like every house on the block needed to be power washed it was so bad like i don't mind power washing the house so that didn't turn me off like i can pretty much see the potential but the pictures and even my video is like not accurate to real life like it was when i say bugs everywhere like we thought the other house had little bug traps it was the bugs and eggs and spider webs and spiders everywhere the floors were not done the floors were literally not connected to the walls like there were the floorboard didn't work the, the little dining formal area was concrete and like outside concrete like great gray, gray concrete then it was like, I didn't even go upstairs because I was so disgusted. The The random island in the kitchen didn't connect to nothing. It was like not centered, but not, 
It was pointless. Um, the bathroom, horrifying. Like the bathroom is what y'all can see that was horrifying on my camera. Because I was I didn't realize that I was doing such a terrible job at videoing, but next time I got y'all. But like, baby, zero out of ten. I will I ran out that house. Ran out that house. That one, the other one needed fifty, sixty thousand worth of work. This one need a hundred K. It need to drop this. All the way down because somebody's gonna have to super flip the house. Like that's a mess. That was a mess. Um, I'm gonna just continue to record this journey. I'm trying to stay motivated. I gotta look at some other houses today to send to my realtor so that we can go see them. Girl, my realtor was scared. We was running out of there. We was running out of there. Mm mm. That was a mess. A whole hot mess. Can't believe that. But that was my experience for today. Um. I'm about to get on a search again. It's going to be a long journey. I don't know what else to do. <laughs> I want to be in a new home by May 1. I need to really start the closing process in like February. So I got time, but I don't got time. That was day one.